AGM presents you a brand new Hallmark series. Ashoff's bodies or nodules are globular, elliptic, or fusiform microscopic structures result from inflammation in the intestinium of the heart, which is characteristic lesion of acute rheumatic fever. Location in interstitium, especially in myocardium and endocardium, often close to small blood vessels, in a significant proportion of atrial appendages. Occasionally, they are present in the pericardium and the adventitia of the aorta. Structure Interstitial fibroinflammatory lesions with macrophages and lymphocytes with necrotic collagen in an area of interstitial fibrosis. Developmental phases Early phase Exudative and degenerative phase up to fourth week. Intermediate phase. Proliferative or granulomatous phase lasts from fourth to twelfth weekend. There is accumulation of anached cow cells. Late phase. Fibrous or healing phase lasts three to four months. Types of cells in Ashoff bodies. Anached cow cells. The caterpillar chromatin pattern of the nucleus and longitudinal section and ally appearance in transverse section characterize anached cow cells. They are macrophages but can derive from myocytes and other connective tissue cells. Anached cow cells can be characteristic but not specific for rheumatic fever and seen in various conditions like metastasis to heart and occasionally seen in the normal fetal and adult hearts. Ashoff giant cells. They are modified anets chow cells with abundant basophilic cytoplasm, ragged cell borders, and one to four nuclei. Other cells, usually seen are lymphocytes, plasma cells, and occasional neutrophils. Three immunohistochemical stages of Ashoff nodules. 1. Ashoff nodule without admix lymphocytes and only macrophages are seen. 2. Ashoff nodules with a few T lymphocytes. 3. Ashoff nodules containing many admix lymphocytes of both B and T cell phenotypes. I hope this high yield presentation is helpful. I would be expecting your suggestions and comments to improve our presentations. This is Dr. Harry and catch you with another exciting presentation next time. Thank you.